How to analyze competitors' backlinks for free. Hello and welcome back again. In this video session, we're going to analyze our competitors' backlinks. Now, before we do, I created this slide so that um, you understand you know, what to look for and the questions that you should be asking when you're looking at your competitor's backlink information. Okay? Because the reason you are analyzing your competitor's backlinks is, you know, perhaps you want to find out backlinking opportunities. Okay? Or perhaps you want to find out why Google is ranking your competitors and so on. Okay? So a backlink analysis on competitors is surely important and it will save time for you while giving you, you know, an opportunity to get a backlink from the same sites. Okay? So let's open up our internet browser. I just wanted to show you this website because there are, you know, many different backlinking websites, as in they show you information about backlinks. And most of them, you know, most popular ones, you know, they claim to be the best on internet and they claim to have the best um, backlinking information for you. Okay? So, you know, I've done a backlinking information on this url okay and that's the url we've taken in this training course okay and as you as you can see this particular um, backlinking website is only showing me three backlinks here okay and this one is only showing me what just one okay and yet these people they want money from you you know in a sense they say to you they have the best information pay us some money we'll show you more Okay, so, you know, I strongly encourage you to stay away and don't fall victim to such claims. Keep your money in your pocket because, as you can see, this particular URL has only found this many, okay? So let's close them up because we know that's not how we do backlink analysis because we want to do it for free and we are smarter than paying our money, okay? So, I've got siteexplorer.info as I've shown you in the SEO tools video session. The reason I've shown you this is because for any keyword ranking, you will eventually you know, um, come to a point where you have to analyze your competitors' backlinks. Okay? And as we can see, this is a free website, and it's gone ahead and it's actually found um, the same information as the other one, perhaps, right? But it gives you a bit more inf information in a sense. The information that you're seeing is more easier to understand for you. Okay? And as we can see, th this is the URLs that is given a backlink to our competitors if our competitor was this domain. Okay? So, you know, looking at that, surely you look at the anchor text. But, you know, as I've tried to relate to you, um, to not worry about all the misinformation about page rank, Alexa rank, and all this stuff, okay? Forget about looking at that data, because I assure you, that's not important for you when you think of getting backlinks for your own website, okay? Instead, you know, keep a close eye on the anchor text, because, you know, you will see how um, th they're backlinking which keywords are important as we can see, okay? And whenever you think to get a backlink for your own website, remember, if you just have the same anchor text over and over and over again, that's not smart. Instead, diversify your anchor text just to stay on the safe side. Although all the information that I have shared and will share in this training course is within Google guidelines, you still have to be be smart because there are a lot of spammers out there um, who who use funny tactics, and because of that, we have to be aware of what they do as well. So therefore, you know, spammers usually you know do um, put keywords and then they just start getting hundreds and thousands of backlinks, thinking that's going to help them. It doesn't work like that. Okay, you need to diversify your anchor text. And sometimes it's okay to use just a URL 
or home or click here and so on okay as your anchor text so we've got another backlinking analysis website here okay I went ahead and conducted another backlink um, you know research on that domain okay on the domain in this example and as you can see this particular free website has actually found more backlinking information on our competitor for example okay so as you can see those who want you to pay money and yet the the information they have is less than the the free version of backlink analysis okay so this is the the main two sites that you should utilize and the reason I show two different ones is because at times these people that they will have different backlinking data for you whereas this one here will have different backlinking data as well so therefore when you combine both of them together you actually kind kind of like have a better um, knowledge about the the backlinking of your competitors okay now we know that when we analyze our competitors we know that the URL is unique on internet that means your domain is allocated to you and you only okay and same is true for your competitors because of that and because of our understanding of of search engine optimization and searching Google then we can actually use Google to find out a bit more detail about the backlinks our competitors are getting and how we do that is you simply copy the the URL of your competitor do so without the WW version okay and simply you know search Google with that but wrap it within quotes okay as we can see I've got double quotes here and then I want to paste that domain and remove any spaces but I also want to minus in URL and then um, paste that in there so basically what I am saying to Google is go and bring me this information in, in its text form okay find websites who has this text mentioned on their pages okay and also don't bring any results that has this in its URL that's why we've put the minus in front of that in URL with colon and then the domain name right so when we search Google as we can see it's bringing us all these results okay and the the domain itself is not not there see it's different domains now why we've done this because it is only in your best interest to actually do this kind of research for backlinks as well because at times perhaps this domain has missed some information about backlinks perhaps even this uh, missed some information okay but oftentimes most website owners they will use their URL as a backlinking um, anchor text okay and because of that and Google you know being the search engine online and having the, the most um, websites indexed okay it will fetch you information that you may want to explore to find out a bit more information about your competitors as we can see that um, text is mentioned here and here and here and so on okay so that is how you do competitor analysis on your competitors and do so for free thank you for learning with me let's continue learning proper search engine optimization methods thank you bye bye